I'm going to have uh, Sinatra put up a uh, rubber siding. <laughs> going to introduce us to your lovely new wife? Well, I would if I had one, but this is my old wife. She's, uh, she's Japanese now. So oh. we're we you. Oh, 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 I miss you. Oh. Golly, geisha, Tokyo Joe. You <laughs> sure are a Far East feast for these Occidental lords. Oh. How, how do you get your hair so stiff and black? It's a wig. And it looks so real. <laughs> Well, you, uh, you sure have, have grown. Uh, I, I'm, I'm Dick. I, I used to hold you when, when you were a little baby. Ew! Sweaty hands! <laughs> Isn't she precious? So, uh, what are you three doing back here? I thought you were living in Zurich. The whole town decided to meet here five years ago on this day to see if you and Joanna would still be alive. And are we... Hard to tell. Looks can be so darn deceiving. <gasps> Hi, everybody. Oh, George. Oh, hey. Michael. Michael. No. Yes. Baby step. Oh. Hi, Dick. It's me, George Utley. Oh. Nice, nice to meet you. It's sure nice to see some things never change. <laughs> so what, is, what have you been doing with yourself? Ate a lot, gained 20 pounds, did slim fast, lost 20 pounds. <laughs> Ate again, gained it all back. <laughs> Went to Arizona, smoked the peace pipe with some neat Navajos. <laughs> After that, I didn't worry about my weight anymore. <laughs> Lord preserve us. It's a wig, okay? Oh, and it looks so real. <laughs> so what's, uh, what's new with you for? Well, after my lovely wife ran off to Puerto Rico with Officer Shiflet, I moved to the Marina del Rey, California, where Jim, Mr. Rusnak, and Miss Goddard have a very spacious houseboat. Just a few slips down from Robert Goulet. <laughs> This is my brother Daryl, and this is my other brother Daryl. <laughs> Allow me to introduce our bitter halves. <laughs> let, let, let me guess. Mary, Carol, and Carol. <laughs> I'm Rhonda, this is my sister Seda, and my other sister Zora. We are from Long Island. <laughs> How did you six uh, meet? Well, my brothers and I Let were... Let me tell them, hon. You see, us three girls were in Atlantic City playing Keno when we see these three dreamboats losing their shorts at the craps table. So I say, Seda, Zora, those three guys are going to be our future hubbies. Swear to God. So we start to mosey over to the dreamboats when these lugs bump into us and knock us on our keisters. We went dripping in gin. Uh-uh, it was Scott. You're both wrong. As I live and breathe, it was amaretto. It was gin. I know what I stunk like. Hey, no, no, it was your, your brothers can speak. Why, why didn't they say anything up till now? I guess they've never been this P.O.'d before. <laughs> Here, uh, go buy yourself something pretty. I never thought I'd hear myself saying this, but uh, I really, I really missed you guys. We missed you, Dick. And our little town. Yeah, like fools, we thought money could buy us happiness. True, true. true. true.
And it has. True. True. We could never move back. Our homes were leveled to create the luxurious 5,000-room Takadachaville Hotel and Country Club. They're booked years in advance. Oh, if only there was some place else in this town to stay. No, there isn't. Nice. I know there's a golf course. Why not stay at the Stratford? No one ever stays here. True, true. 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 Well, I, yeah, I, I guess you could check in for, you know, for a night or two. A night or two? We'll stay forever! No, yes. Wait, wait, no, wait, wait, we, we don't, uh, we, we don't have uh, enough rooms for all, all of you and, and your wives and your children. It's merely a matter of living arrangements. We can work it out. We can work it out. Only time will tell if I'm right or I'm wrong. <laughs> As Mayor Emeritus, I hereby declare an emergency town meeting to be held at once in the sofa area of the Stratford to discuss who will be bunking with who. Yeah. 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 If it's okay, what, what? Chester, I, I'd like to bunk with my wife and daughter. Uh -huh. I mean my bunny burger and small fry. Uh -huh. oh. <laughs> my brothers and I would like a room for ourselves and a separate room for our wives. <laughs> Preferably in a different town. I refuse to bunk with Mr. Rusnick. He snorts like a pig. My septum happens to be badly well, deviated. I don't mind. So you want to be bunk with me? Done deal. No, no one is listening to me. And I tend to linger. Yeah, well, and you Honey. <laughs> honey, honey, wake up. You, you won't believe the dream I just had. Mm. But don't you want to hear about it? Bob, what is it? Well, I, I was an innkeeper in this crazy little town in Vermont. I'm happy for you. Good night. No, nothing, nothing made sense in this place. I mean, the, the, the maid was an heiress. Her, her husband talked in, in alliteration. The, the handyman kept missing the, the point of things. And then there were these... Three woodsmen, but <laughs> on, only one of them talked. That settles it. No more Japanese food before you go to bed. <laughs> and, I, and I was married to this, this beautiful blonde. Go back to sleep, bum. Good night, Ellen. Mm -hmm. What do you mean, beautiful blonde? <laughs> Go to sleep, Emily. Yeah. You know, you, uh... You really should wear more sweaters. 